A noticeable decline in the number of people making trips to health clinics for those routine checkups, and that has doctors concerned. Uh, Channel 5's Catalina Cruz found out the price uh, you may pay by neglecting your health. Catalina? The doctor I spoke with says there tends to be a mentality in the valley of only going to the clinic when you're sick. She says it's problematic because in the end, it leads to more financial strain and burden. From seeing a couple dozen patients a day to only a handful this month, this mobile clinic saw a sharp decline in patient visits. Amongst those getting a checkup is 62-year-old Miguel Lopez. Me tomaron la medida, me, me tomaron peso, me chequearon el azúcar. It wasn't always a habit of his to get a routine checkup. Financial struggles prevented him from doing so. Yo casi siempre iba muy, muy poco. Dr. Michelle Cordoba Kesi says finances isn't the only roadblock for low-income patients. In the Valley, traditionally, there has been um, a lack of access to care. And so um, people, it's sort of new for, especially an older generation, to seek care when they're not sick, like preventative medicine. She wants the community to know taking your health for granted is a big mistake. Both financially and for the health of the patient, it's much more beneficial to come to the doctor when you're well, to learn ahead of time, do you have high blood pressure, do you have diabetes, can we screen you for cancer? So to be proactive in your health, come to the clinic and learn about problems that you may have ahead of time is um, very important because nowadays we have many things to intervene before we develop you know, end-stage complications. Lopez failed to see a doctor when he developed a small bump behind his ear. It was cancer that over time became aggressive. Years later, he's still battling the disease. Other diseases may also cost your family and friends if left untreated. If one person is sick, um, both from a medical standpoint, so if it's something infectious or a communicable disease, you know, that one person can affect, infect their family, their community, other people they work with, other people they go to school with. Dr. Cordoba Kesi tells us in the end, your health is in your hands. A minimal payment today will pay off in the long run. Lopez says his cancer damaged facial nerves, causing a stroke-like appearance on his left side. He now frequents the doctor, but says it's a habit he wishes he would have picked up sooner. A lesson learned he wants you to keep in mind. Live in the studio, Carolina Cruz, Channel 5 News at 6.